in this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to fund your futures account on BitGet. Before I do though, if you by chance don't already have an account with BitGet, I'll leave a sign up link in the video description where you can save 20% on your trade fees. So in order to fund your futures account, you first need to fund your spot wallet. If you're in Canada, I've already made a video outlining and showing the best way to fund your BitGet spot wallet in Canada. I'll leave a link to that video in the video description. After you've funded your spot wallet, you'll need to obtain USDT. You can do that by trading whatever coin that you have in your spot wallet for it. If you've followed my funding video, you'll have sent over USDC to your spot wallet. You can then trade your USDC for USDT. You can do that by going here to trade and then hover over spot and then over here in the search box, you're going to enter in USDC and then you're going to click on the first option that appears. When you do, it'll bring the trade dashboard of the USDC slash USDT trade pair. So to obtain USDT, you'll want to go over here and then click on sell because you're selling your USDC and then click on market and then enter in the amount of USDC that you'd like to sell for USDT. So example, if you let's just say go all the way over to 100% and then click on sell USDC, you will then have roughly same amount of USDT in your spot wallet. After you have the USDT in your spot wallet, you're then going to go over here to hover over this wallet icon and then click on transfer. After you click on it, it'll bring you to a page that looks like this, where it's basically asking you where you would like to transfer your funds from. So from your spot into your futures account. So that looks pretty good. And then you're going to select the coin. The only coin that you can select is USDT. So that's all that you're going to do. And then click on all after you're going to click on confirm. And there you go. You can now see that the funds have been transferred over to your futures account. So with the USDT in your futures account, you can now use that USDT to trade futures. Hope you learned something and thanks for watching.